Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, those of you don't know what the hell you are yet. Hop along PR here. We are back playing Persona 5, and my best friend, who also played this game with me, and has been my primary source of intel for this game, because I'm doing a blindish run through. But he has told me, well, kind of, bitched ad nauseum about the final boss. Multiple stages, multiple appendages, and tons of recovery. So, I am... Uh, can't make anything else. I was going to say, I was going to make coffee while she made curry, because SP is going to be king. But... Let's see if there's absolutely anybody who wants to hang out. The answer to that question, no. No one wants to hang out with me. So, I guess, I don't know. I don't think there's anything I'd actually want on Shady Commodities, is there? Might as well at least check one more time. Unholy armor. You know what? Fuck it, why not? I have no idea what that would do. I'm curious about it, but I don't think I'm going to be able to get 500,000 yen. Alright, so that's taken care of. Let's make some more tools, because why not? Mm. So close. Oh well. Okay. Make it alone. Kawakami's already doing something. What are your thoughts? Let's see. Okay. Have a nice five amount. As well as they have a nice even five, but five's not an even number. What are your thoughts? And make another treasure map because you know what are your thoughts having treasure a shadows pop up is always a good thing Interesting. Nope, not using any of my liquid mercury. Fuck that shit, dude. Okay. Might as well make it one more time because I don't know how long that last dungeon is. What are your thoughts? See, I, I don't have problems with that. With my stealth. Uh, okay. Might as well do that. I can't tell you how many times I just wanted to run from battles. What are your thoughts? Hmm. And another lockpick. Because okay. why the fuck not? What are your thoughts? Yeah. Yep. All right, so from here on out, I just need to start well, asking Kawakami to make me coffee. I have enough curry. It's all coffee at this point. Much like how I get up in the morning. Hi. Just pour coffee into me and I'm good. The more caffeinated, the better. Because Lord Jesus knows I am not a morning person. I sound like a zombie in the morning. And not not a pleasant zombie at that. It's not the type that you'll just like, you'll see meandering on his own. No. The type of zombie that is running after you. That type of zombie. The not fun zombie. Well then. Let's see. I don't think anybody's going to be available because it's cold. 
Are you kidding me? Ugh. Fine. I wonder if there's anything new in the crane game. Think it's gonna stick? And shush, yes. I know fast travel is an option. Lexi? The fuck is Lexi? Lexi looks kind of scary. I don't know if I want this decorating my room, but I'm going to get it anyhow, goddammit. It's material things. <laughs> it knows I have a problem. I don't say it's a problem. It's only a problem when I'm not winning. Yeah, that's a problem. Um, let's see. Do I have anything that I could wash? Nope. Huh. So little to do now that my stats are actually all maxed out. I'm gonna give the batting cages another go. Maybe I can get the slugger. Choked on the last one. <laughs> oh well. At least time progressed. Wanna head back? Now please let the adults that have helped actually want to hang out. Ah, you're back. Okay, cool. Let's see, can I? Yep. Hey. <laughs> I can creep away all the customers. That's good to know. Okay, so I have someone to talk to now. Yay. I bet he's put a few things together. Let's see. Listen. Something crazy happened. What's up? I got a call from Suda. I want to tell you the details. You got some time? I suppose. Let's hang out with him. Good. Oh, goddamn. I don't have any persona of his, don't I? Fuck. Actually. Hey, you're exactly the person I was hoping to talk to. Suda rang me up a while back, told me to forget everything he was threatening me with. I honestly thought it was kind of a joke at first, but I ain't seen or heard from him since. Hmm. You know, it almost felt like I was talking to the old Suda somehow, my sworn brother. You think a guy can go through dressing change that quick? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't really want to talk, but you should probably think about taking this a little more seriously, kid. Anyway, something fishy is still going down. The suit is changing is a real load off my shoulders. That's right. Oh, probably means our deal's through with, huh? I mean, your end of the bargain was driving Suda away, and you did that and then some. One more thing. Yo. You know, I kind of fired you and all, but you think you'd maybe want to work here with me? 
I understand kids these days have all sorts of commitments, so I get the answer is no. Ah! If you pay me well. <laughs> Don't really expect me to make your job any easier. Here, we're counting on you, kid. Um, hop along. Hooray! Kick myself for not getting one first. <laughs> Hooray! Work to the bone. Even though my proficiency is already maxed out, I will say that is a good thing about this game. It gave you right. a lot See of you. ways to level up a lot of different things. Kawakami, what's that? Hi! All right. See you tomorrow. All right, so, oh, really? We're, oh, we did have a little go up. That's right, I forgot. It was at like, what, two, 3%? Well then. Let's see, who, Empress or Emperor? Do I have any of said persona on me already? I have Empress. So let's go say hi to, oh, not there, Haru. Plus we're getting close to, you know, seeing what exactly happened to good old Shido? You know, now that we've thoroughly been through his mind. I'm impressed I could sneak all the way up here. <laughs> hey! We should have mental shutdowns anymore, yes? Should. That aside, what brings you to the rooftop? Came to see you! Thank you. I thank you. The vegetables and the planters are doing well. I could show them to you if you'd like. Yep. Let's hang out with her. Thank you. I was just take a look. Thank you. It really helps. Let me go for a walk while you're busy with her. Let me know when you're ready to leave. Gotcha. <laughs> Soil is quite a mysterious thing. With its gentle care, even a tidy seed can awaken, sprout its roots, and grow up towards the sun. It's almost like a mother. Perhaps that aspect is why I find this place so comforting. You know, I only started taking care of these planters because one of my teachers asked me to. I was hesitant at first, but I liked how much that I kept them long past the original request. I started mixing my own fertilizer and adjusting the soil ratios. Now I raise these plants in complete secret. But, um, hop along, Coon. I'm worried that the school might... What they must school might do if they found out about this. They won't find out. <laughs> so bold. In that case, I guess it can be our little secret. Honestly, hop along. I really enjoy the time we spend together. Instead of from how I feel when I'm around him. Oh, sorry. I met my fiance. It reminds me, though. I want to ask you your advice about him. Um. The whole arrangement between my father first introduced us around the beginning of this year. I was told we were meeting his friend for dinner, but then he said that friend was to be my fiance. It was surprising, but I suppose I had always known that I would someday be married off for a political gain. So I accepted, and that was the start of our relationship. Oh, <laughs> uh, but no. Relationship. That stuff happened. Just be clear. Anyway, I was never exactly fond of him to begin with, but now he's grown far worse. Recently, he's been suggesting we go on an early honeymoon together to celebrate our coming marriage. I can't even stand to look at him. Yet alone spending my actual prolonged time together. So what can I say to decline this offer? I... <laughs> I don't want to go out with you. Plain and simple. Right. I suppose it would be the best simply clear about. Um. As you know, my father passed away before he could fulfill his promise to rescind the marriage proposal. So any conversation about putting that to a halt would have to come from me. To tell you the truth, I've already mentioned it to my fiance. But he refuses to listen to a single word I say. Apparently there's even 
been telling the employees of Akamaro Foods at the contract he made with my father. How the company would have to pay extreme reparations if he got called off for any reasons. I just don't know how to handle this. I can postpone while I'm still in high school, but after that... Thinking about it, it seems my father's death turned out to be quite favorable for my fiance. After all, he's now engaged to the majority shareholder of a massive company. Suppose in the end he all cares about his own personal gain. That's not what a relationship is supposed to be built on. It should be something more. Something like a love so intense just seeing the other person makes you your chest tighten up. I'm not so sure. You ever experience that? <laughs> ah, yeah. Really? Yep. So romantic. Makes me a little jealous of you and the girl. Woman. But there's no spark like that with my fiance. Spending time with him is almost kind of training. Yes. Still, any hardship I go through now will surely help the phantom thieves eventually. I'll get through this. Good ish mindset. Nah. I just say fuck off, dude. If it's money he wants, fine. Again, I am the person who chooses to chase his own freedom despite what the smart thing may be. It's getting late. Should probably get back to my gardening. Well, I think I'll be seeing you here a little while longer. Goodbye. Bye bye, Haru. Come on. I know. I just want it to happen. Whatever it may be. Uh, you're back. Got a scoop. All right. Do I have a devil on me? That is an interesting question. I do. Hey. It's called yeah. Kalakami. Make sure you close up. Yeah, I am getting this motherfucker stockpiled. Sure come here a lot. And I don't really mind, but keep yourself in check, okay? What's up, Oya? Hey! Oh, there you are. You won't believe how weird the Chief's been acting. Really? How weird is that? Sit down so I can give you the details. You got a scoop. Yep, we're gonna hang out with her. Come on, sit, now take a seat. Sit. She's excited. <laughs> so the chief reduced my quota, and he even apologized to me. Wow, that is both nice. He said he's been concerned for my health, which is actually kind of creepy now that I think about it. Anyway, that's not all. He said he's letting me reopen my investigation into what happened to Keo. He told me he wants to do everything. I think I can pursue the truth. I think he was serious. You know what happened to make him change his mind so suddenly? Aren't you happy? Of course I am. It's just... Hmm. Things too convenient. Seems a little fishy, you know? I mean, you asked me for the chief's name the other day, right? Did I? Can't remember. <laughs> hmm... Why are you giving him such a hard time? Aren't you going to tell him the other good news? I... I know where K.O. is. That was part of the Chief's apology to me. Apparently he did some investigating on his own. He followed up on my journalist friend's source and... Turns out she's alive after all. Glad to hear that. This is incredible news. So where is she? Right in front of me. Oh... That explains why she hasn't been able to contact me the whole time. Well, I won't go see her, but to be honest, I'm afraid. Afraid to know the truth. It's also Kao's current state, but what happened to her that night, too? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Hmm. I'll go with you. Huh? That's really considerate of you, but the hospital she's in is far out in the countryside. But thank you. Give me the courage I need to do this. I'm going to see her. No matter what happens, I need to see this through to the end. 
Otherwise, it wouldn't be Ichikira. Oh, yeah. Journalist extraordinaire. I'm really glad I talked to you about this. Never would have made up my mind without your help. You know, you're way more than just some high school kid. You're almost like my guidance counselor. Thank you. Just keep it at guidance counselor. All right. Oh, by the way, everything with Chief worked out okay, but the higher ups are still keeping an eye on me. So I need you to keep the juicy tidbits coming. Can't stop writing about the pan thieves now. <laughs> All right, let's see what you have for me today. <laughs> yes, all these stories that I happen to know. All right. Well then. Can't wait for next time. Hi. Sup, cow, cowy. More coffee. Yay. See you later. Bye. And is this the last day before? Or is this the day of? Day before. Mm -hmm. I say Futaba. What do my persona say? Futaba works. See ya, Papa Sakura. Hey. Gonna go hang out with the little one. Sup? Yo. Everything's finished, right? We can do is wait like always. <laughs> Promiseless. What should we do next? Yes. Let's hang out with her. All right. She's an adorable little sister. So the next promise is, learn about my generation. Wait, I can do the next one too. Have a normal conversation with a stranger my age. Hmm, where can I find young people? All right, let's go. By Jove, I think I've got it. Let us be off, off along. Uh -huh. Wow, you guys have actually started getting pretty close. Not like that's a bad thing though. Anyway, be careful out there. Will do, Papa Sakura. So we arrived at the diner. Heard all about the unlimited fountain drinks at these places. Well, where are they? I don't see them anywhere. Hi. Big poop bad? Oh crap, and you're with a girl? Is this a friend of yours? He's in my class, yeah. He's also, oh, you know, right. dude who helps with the fan site. Well. Just wanna have a regular conversation. So wait, you're seeing you, a girl. Want to talk to me? Yeah. In that case, I guess I don't have a choice. Nope, none whatsoever. Just have to help you out. Really? You're so nice. My name's Futaba Sakura. Don't you forget it. Uh, okay. I'm Yuki Mishima, but everyone just calls me Mishima. Hmm, helps with always problems when I need it most. <laughs> Maybe luck sets really high. <laughs> I think you're right. <laughs> oh, D and D, such a fun game with the right people. See. So, you want to learn about our generation? That'll be easy to explain. Youth, the unknown frontier. Maybe we should try talking about my hobbies. Um, Do you like computers? Yes. Mm hmm. I'm always online. Me too. I just use. I usually use forums for myself. We're more into streaming. I'd like to subscribe to your channel. Wait, do you run one of those racy channels? You need to be super cautious if you do that. Though we certainly wouldn't be unwelcome. Wow. That's the first time I've actually heard anyone say that out loud. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's all you took from that conversation? Yep. I see. Uh, I've got it. This overwhelmingly forgettable appearance, genetic speech style, and total lack of sex appeal. Nishima, are you an NPC? 
He's the protagonist. Really? Huh. Guess you can't judge a book by its cover. All right. Anyway, I'm glad you spawned here. I killed two promises with one Nishima today. Learn about my generation. I have a normal conversation with a stranger of my own age. Normal might be pushing it. <laughs> Not a problem, little sister. So, uh, Futaba-chan? It's okay to call you that, right? A little embarrassed. Anyway, what are you doing after this? Going home. All right. Sorry, Mishima. She's an odd child. But that's why she's just so adorable. Tomorrow's the day. We're going to it, people. Fuck it. Candidates are working extra hard. After all, voting does take place tomorrow. So, nothing from Shido? Huh. That bastard just blow the whole thing off. No, probably not. Do you think we should cut into another TV broadcast? Let's wait. I agree. We don't want to stick out too much right now. It's likely got some kind of speech after the election. What's that going to be? Assuming it sets the results, come in tomorrow night. I can only hope that he actually confesses his crimes. Another box came for you. Hooray! I can do laundry now! <laughs> hey. It's called Kawakami. Make sure you close up. Hi! Alright. And Oh please. Please, fortune teller. Help me rank up with him. Yes, come on. Fortune reading. Affinity. There we go. I hope I don't need money for anything coming up. Here we go. Mm-hmm. Should Ah, poop. What do you think? It's not enough. Guess I'll grab the hangman persona just because. Fine, Caroline. 